Hello traders, welcome to Simple Trading Style and today we are going to talk about daily stock market update and we will figure out is it still bearish market trend, what's going on with the stock market world on daily time frame and as usually let's move to my five rules of risk management, please read it and follow it every single trade and you will be successful. Now it's the time for trading view. Let's start from stock market heat map based on the, mar uh, on the market cap, all USA companies daily performance and all sectors are green i'm sorry are all sectors red right all sectors are red only tesla green amazon green but generally red and black let's move to my watch list and we will do technical analysis review as usually let's start from dxy dxy if you want to learn more about, tra about trading new setup, just go to the description. There is the link about trading new setup training and other links about all my trainings. Now let me briefly mention about my setup. I'm using simple moving averages. White line SMA 200, purple line SMA 100, blue line SMA 50, yellow line SMA 20, red line SMA 10, green line SMA 5. Below yellow line, RSI line, and Heikonachi bars. That's all. Very simple. It's not easy because emotions involved. If you follow the indicators, you will be successful because indicators do not have emotions. Like on my chart, you see red circle when SMA5 green line did bearish crossover over red. It was entry for bearish trend. And green circle when SMA5 line did bullish crossover over red. It was bullish trend. Today we received sell signal, it was rejected from SMA 20 yellow line and now last bar closed today below all moving averages. Still bearish trend, still in the bearish territory DXY, it is bullish for equities, dollar still bearish. NASDAQ, NASDAQ uh, triple Q, triple Q daily time frame. Last bar just dancing, last three bars they are dancing about below, above, below SMA 100, but it is still support line, it can bounce from this level. So far, trend is beige. Four hours time frame, similar in dancing around SMA 200 level, white line SMA 200 for last four bars, it is dancing around SMA 200. And one hour time frame is below, definitely it's below SMA 200 bearish trend, but it's a bearish setup. Also, SMA 20 is bearish crossover, it is bearish setup. It can bounce, definitely it can bounce. It has some bullish divergence on the side, but so far trend is bearish. VXN volatility index today negative, minus 3%. Still last bar about, about all moving averages, still in the bullish territory, but today day is negative. SPX, S&P 500, all, also flat today, minus quarter percent, Q's were, all Q's were also flat. Uh, S&P 500, SPX, last bar close below SMA 20 yellow line, still bearish trend. Last two bars, three bars, they touched SMA 50 and they're dancing around SMA 50 level. Let's see. Yeah, partially it closed that gap. Still gap still in place. <laughs> it has multiple gaps below, but trend is bench. Four hours time frame, similar, it's a lot of support uh, in this area, SMA 100, SMA 50. Definitely can bounce, but so far trend is bench. And one hour time frame, SMA 200 strong support line. It definitely can bounce from the support line. And or it even can go a little bit lower to fill the gap and will continue bounce. Bearish trend with strong support. VIX volatility index for S&P 500 also today minus six and a, a three quarter percent. Last bar about all moving averages still bullish trend, but day was negative. 
Dow Jones minus half percent daily time frame sell signal last bar indeed touched SMA 20 level SMA 20 strong support line it fills this gap bearish reversal signal can bounce from SMA 20 yes it can but trend is bearish four hours time frame same last bar below SMA 5 10 and 20 bearish trend and one hour time frame also bearish trend VXD volatility index for Dow Jones. Last bar still above all moving averages, still bullish trend and the bullish territory. IWM Russell 2000 minus half percent daily time frame. Sell signal SMA 5 in bearish crossover over 10. Last bar close below SMA 20, SMA 50. Bearish trend. Bearish trend daily. Four hours time frame, last bar below SMA, below all moving averages, right? Below all moving averages, bearish trend. And one hour time frame, SMA 20 did bearish crossover over 200, bearish trend in all indicators. RVX volatility index for Russell 2000, I think it was red today, but still last bar above all moving averages, still bullish trend. All volatility index is still bullish. Apple. Apple was positive today. Plus three quarter percent daily time frame. Last bar still below SMA 20, below SMA 50. Still bearish trend. Four hours time frame. Last bar still below SMA 20. Also still bearish trend. One hour time frame, it did nice bounce. RSI was, you see, RSI was in oversold territory. It did bounce. And it even did bullish crossover over 20. Last bar about 20, it is bullish territory. Tesla plus 5%. Daily time frame, last bar about all moving averages, bullish trend. Four hours time frame, last bar about all moving averages. Bullish trend. One hour time frame. Last bar about all moving averages. Bullish trend. Bullish trend, right? And Nvidia. Nvidia sideways. One hour time frame. Sideways. And video sideways still bearish in the bearish territory, still bearish trend. Four hours time frame, last bar below all moving averages, also bearish trend. RSI did touched over over sold territory. Definitely it can balance from it. Daily time frame, last bar below all moving averages except 200. It is bearish trend. Nvidia bearish. Microsoft. Microsoft flat today. Last bar below all moving averages. Bearish trend for my for Microsoft. Four hours time frame. Same last bar below all moving averages. Bearish trend. One hour time frame. Last bar below all moving averages. Also bearish trend. Amazon. One hour time frame, bullish crossover, last bar above all moving averages, bullish trend. Four hours time frame, last bar above all moving averages, except 200 and 100, bullish crossover, bullish trend. Daily time frame, last bar above all SMA 20, it is bullish trend. Google daily time frame Google last bar at SMA 200 level. As a strong support line, it can bounce from this line. The trend is bearish. Four hours time frame last bar below all moving averages, bearish trend. And one hour time frame last bar below 
yellow line below SMA20 bearish trend. Meta, meta one hour time frame, SMA5, 10 and bars of bullish crossover over 20, bullish trend. Four hours time frame, last bar below SMA20, SMA5, 10 and bars below 20, bearish trend. Daily time frame, SMA5, 10 and bars below SMA20, bearish trend. bearish trend right okay generally let's do summary USA dollar still bearish all equities and indexes they all in the bearish trend but they kind of stopped at the strong support lines and it can be bounced but generally trend is bearish for all equities and accept accept Amazon right um, Amazon bullish and Tesla is bullish Amazon and Tesla bullish Everything else still in the bearish trend. That's all. Let's move to my disclaimer. I'm not a financial advisor. This video for educational and informational purposes only. Remember, for educational purpose, we are using Paper Training Simulator. Thank you for watching Simple Training Style videos. I do publish daily, weekly, monthly updates for stocks, ETFs, indexes, and cryptos. Please subscribe to this YouTube channel, click like button to support this channel. I really appreciate all your efforts. Thank you so much and good luck. Bye now.